Hey everyone, Digital David here. Today in this video, we're gonna be unboxing and reviewing the Smart Floor Lamp. I did receive this product review, but any opinion expressed in this video is strictly my own. That being said, if you're interested in this item or wanna find out more about it, the link to it will be in my video description below. Please go ahead, check it out, and do your shopping from there. Here's how it comes packaged in a nice and simple retail box. We can see from this side, we have the Smart Life app that we can download on our iOS and Android devices. So it works with Amazon Alexa and Google Assistant. Then we can learn more about the product features on this side as well. It's 25 watts, 2000 lumens. It has adjustable whites ranging from 2700 Kelvins all the way up to 6500 Kelvins, RGB color and a built-in USB port. And it has a music sync mode as well. Now let's go ahead, let's open it up and look at the package contents. Here are all the package contents. You can see we got our power supply right here. We have our lamp base. It's very heavy. We're just gonna twist to attach everything to the base. We can look at the back side as well. Then we can take a look at the top of the lamp. Here's the actual LED light section itself. It's gonna shine light on the top and the bottom of this lamp. And then we can look at our main section pieces right here, all attached together with the included power cord. And we can see we have our controls right here for the lamp and a USB port, it's five volt, one amp. Now let's go ahead, let's get the lamp assembled. So assembly is gonna consist of threading all the pieces together. As you can see right here, we're just gonna go ahead and we're gonna start threading them in place. Just finger tight, make sure you have the threads lined up properly and continue to fasten them in place until it's nice and snug. Now repeat this process for the rest of the lamp. Now that we got this section assembled, let's work on assembling the top half of the lamp. For the top section, go ahead, just push it in place, line up the threads and finger tighten it as well until it's nice and tight in place. Now we can look at this end and you can see we have a different sort of adapter that's gonna connect to the main body piece that we just assembled. So let's go ahead, let's plug those in right now. So the connectors only fit one way, so go ahead and plug them in together just like you see right here. Now work on assembling this last section together before we put it on the base. Now we're ready to take the assembled lamp and connect it to its base. We have one last thread to twist on. You can see we have the lamp completely assembled. Now on your iOS or Android device, go over to your mobile app store and download the Smart Life app. Once you have the Smart Life app downloaded, you'll be at this home screen where we can add a new device. So in the top right hand corner, select the blue circle plus icon. And now we can select lighting from the left hand side. And now we're gonna select the first icon that says lighting Wi-Fi. Go ahead, select that. Now we need to reset the device. In this case, identify the power button and hold the power button down for between five and 10 seconds until it starts to flash. So we're holding it down, it's gonna flash. There we go, it's flashing rapidly. Let's go ahead and confirm. Now we need to enter our Wi-Fi information. Make sure you're on a 2.4 gigahertz Wi-Fi network before you proceed. So go ahead, enter your username and password and hit confirm. Now it's gonna work on setting up the device for us the rest of the way. So it took less than 30 seconds. Now you can see the device was successfully added. We can go ahead and select done. Now it's gonna take us into the device settings so we can view all the options that we have to control. So now in the top right hand corner, we can select the edit icon. This will allow us to view and change more device details so we can change the name. We can learn about third party controls and see support documentation and how to set them up if you wanted to set this lamp up with Amazon Alexa, Google Assistant and a bunch of other options right there. We can also share this device if we want to share this device with friends or family members, we can do that right here. We can also create a group if you wanna group this device with other smart devices throughout your home. And then we can view more device specific information like firmware updates. We can remove the device or restore it to factory defaults. Then we can go back to the main screen right here and we can look in the bottom left hand corner, we have a timer. So we can select that. We can choose the hour and the minute and hit okay, and then we're gonna have it on a timer. And now you can see we got four more options to go over near the top. We have white, color, scene, and music. So let's go ahead, let's turn off all the studio lights so we can test out the light's brightness and see those colors in more detail. 
Now with the studio lights off, you can see how bright this lamp is and how it casts light above and below. We're currently in the white tab right now, so we can adjust the color temperature and the brightness of the whites. So you can see we can take it all the way down to 2700 kelvins, which is a nice warm light. And then we can take it all the way up to 6500 kelvins, which is a nice cool light. Or we can select somewhere in between if we desire. So you can see, just slide your finger around the app to set it to whatever white light you want. Then we can go down to the bottom with a slider right here so we can adjust the brightness. There's 74%. Here's around 50%, 51%. Here's 26%, and then here's 1%. So we can bring that all the way back up. Now let's check out the color tab. So we can choose whatever color we want, and we can adjust the brightness again right here, all the way down. There's around 51%. We can go back up to 100%, and then we can adjust the saturation too. So watch the color change and get less vibrant. So you can see we can really pull that down to 0%. We're all the way back up to 100%. So we have a ton of color variations since we can tweak so much right here. Let's just slide it around so you can see all the different colors they have. So many combinations depending on your mood and what you feel like. We'll keep moving it around. Very responsive. The app's really easy to use. Now we're getting back to the greens again. And now we're ready to check out the scene mode. So we have multiple scenes right here. So first up we have your night scene. And we can edit all of these scenes. So we could change the picture, change the name, the flash mode, and the speed. Then we have your read mode. Same thing, we have the edit icon. So you can view what you can change. We have your working mode. We have your leisure. We have your soft, colorful, and again, you can hit the edit tab and you can see what can be changed again. We can select the scene colors and the speed. We have dazzling, here's dazzling. Again, we can edit that as well. You can see our options to change. And we have your gorgeous, mode right here. Same thing, we can edit that as well. A couple different flash modes too that you can see right there. Now we can go to music mode. So music mode works great and it will vary depending on the type and style of music you're listening to. Now let's go ahead, let's check out Amazon Alexa. So to set the lamp up with Amazon Alexa, go ahead, open your Alexa app and then select the icon in the top left hand corner. Now it's the fourth option up from the bottom. You wanna select skills and games. Now we're gonna search for the Smart Life app because we need to enable Smart Life as a skill. So hit the search icon, start typing in Smart Life Go ahead, hit search. It will be the first option that populates for you. Go ahead, select it. Now at this step, you're gonna need to enable the skill. This screen says disable because we've already enabled the skill for the Smart Life app and Amazon Alexa. You'll only have to do this once for the first product you ever set up with a Smart Life integration with Alexa. After that, they will automatically be added for you. So go ahead, select enable skill on your screen and then enter your Smart Life credentials and you're all set, you're good to go to start using Amazon Alexa. So let's try it out. Alexa, power on David. Okay. There we go, Alexa just turned the lamp on. I renamed it to my own name. Now we can go ahead, we can tell Alexa to power it off. Hey Alexa, power off David. Okay. So Alexa just turned the lamp off. Hey Alexa, power on David and change color to red. There we go, Alexa just powered on and changed the color to red. Hey Alexa, decrease David brightness to 1%. Okay. 
And there we go, Alexa just decreased the lamp's brightness to 1%, so Alexa works great. Now we got a smartphone with a USB charging cable that we can plug into the lamp. So we have it plugged in and it's charging our device just fine. Now for the lamp controls, we have our power button and then we have our light mode button. So you can see we can go and we can tap it once and we can rotate through a lot of different colors. We even have one setting on here that will cycle through a bunch of the colors for you as you can see right here. We can go ahead too and we can just keep going until we get back to the beginning with our whites. And then if you wanna dim or increase the brightness, just go ahead, hold it down on whatever color you want and it's gonna to start to dim the light. And then we can hold it down again and it's gonna to start to increase the light's brightness as well until you're at the max brightness. So the controls are really easy and intuitive to use. So overall guys, you can see the smart lamp's really easy to set up and use. I'm a big fan of any smart product that uses the Smart Life app because it integrates so easily with Amazon Alexa, Google Assistant. And I just like using that app because so many third party manufacturers use that app with their smart products. So you can have all of your smart products under one app to control. And I really can't stress enough how important that is, at least to myself. I reviewed a smart lamp that was very similar by the brand Tekken. But I really like the design of this lamp a lot better because it casts light above and below. In the future though, I'd like to see this lamp have the ability to really adjust a lot further. The Tekken lamp can adjust 90 degrees basically so you could shine it all the way down here. Now again, that's not bad for reading and it's gonna cast a lot of light up towards your ceilings, but I just wish we had more of an option right here to pivot it. But the controls are a lot better than the touch panel on the Tekken lamp that I reviewed. So I'm really happy with these buttons. They're touch sensitive as well, but they're just a lot easier to use and they make sense. And this lamp is RGB. The Tekken lamp was not RGB. And they went ahead and they threw a USB port on this lamp as well. So I really like that idea. So you could charge your phone straight from the couch, desk, whatever this lamp is near, you have that flexibility. Now I would like to see that become a fast charging USB port. In the future, it is just a regular and slow charging one amp USB port, but it's really nice that they gave us that option. So it's RGB, it's dimmable, you have controllable whites too, that's a huge bonus. So I like all those features. Now, two things I wanna point out as well, they gave me a European power supply. I'll be sure to link to the correct ones in the video description below. Depending on your country, that may be the power supply you want, or you're gonna want a different version like the US version. Also wanna point out, I found it really strange that the Smart Life app did not have the scheduling functionality for this lamp right now. They just had the timer settings. So I don't know if that'll be added in the future or if that's just a feature that's missing from this lamp. Not that big of a deal, but since it is a smart lamp, it would be nice to have that feature in the future. If you're interested in this product, the link to it will be in my video description below. Please go ahead, check it out, and do your shopping from there. Hit that like button for us. Subscribe to our channel. We have new content coming out daily. Don't want you guys to miss anything. Thank you, thank you, thank you for being here. Please don't hesitate to reach out with questions comments or concerns, I'd be happy to answer them for you or point you in the right direction. Follow us online, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. You can message us on WeChat. Check out our website, join our free newsletter, guys. Follow us on Twitch and join our Discord server. Thank you for watching and we can't wait to see you in our next video.